All right, welcome back to Isodom Challenge. Uh, if I can resize this window correctly, okay. Isodom Challenge. Um, this is week number four. It's Alchemy Week. We're playing with four... Uh, Things for Alchemy Week. Things being uh, uh, cards that cost whatchamacallum. Um, oh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I think we're going to go Young Witch Chapel. Want to get some cursing in on him real quick. Uh, I don't... Because there's other cursing in this in the set, I don't think the other stuff is so important. And he's unlikely to get a familiar anytime soon. Although, hey, he hits very nicely for him there. Um, this does not hit well for me. I'm going to get just a little bit of money to start off with. Um, yeah, that's a really good draw for him. Um, I want to get two silvers, I think, and then start picking up like villages. Okay, we're gonna get we gotta get a wharf here, so it's just gonna be villages real quick. Um lots of villages here really quickly. I wanna make a big engine and I don't think these potion cost cards are super necessary for that. Uh, with the great trashing afforded by trap chapel and uh, yeah um, gonna pick up a village Sweet. Now, Pearl Diver's non-terminal. Okay. Maybe that's not the best buy with, with uh, terminal card draw, but okay. It's what we get. Um, I suppose I'll get an herbalist at this point. I'm planning on getting more villages up here soon. Oh, uh, that herbalist was definitely a mistake. I don't know what I'm thinking. I already have three terminals. Ufta. Um, he's getting rid of his potion. He only wanted it for his one familiar. Interesting. Well, I think that shows to be a clear mistake. Um, herbalist and copper, so I can trash these two curses. Grab another village. Um, very close to even here. Now he has a little more money, but I have a wharf already. Pearl Diver is important to play first before these other things because uh, it lets me use the cycling of the Pearl Diver right away. Um, going to get rid of Copper and Herbalist here. Chapel up curse away, buy a silver. Again, want to play this first so that I can grab the young witch here. Um, six is going to be for a village and silver. Want to keep this going this this nice chain uh, action chain uh, now all the curses are gone um, I'm drawing my whole deck fairly reliably the next step is going to be to get another wharf and probably a village okay Put another silver back. 
Um, I think there's significantly more deck building that we can do before uh, Chaplain Copper. Good, that's a good draw for me. Um, let's pick up a gold and silver. Um, we're going to hope we want to get rid of a couple more coppers maybe soon. Pick up some more drawing with Wharf before we green. Um, now he's still got some curses he's slogging through it looks like to me. Yeah? Because he has six points from his province but only three points total. There's three curses left he has in his deck. Um, village Village, village, young witch, drop a chapel on a copper, village, yes, wharf, pearl diver, nah, 13 is going to be a wharf, a wharf, and a village, put the gold back. Um, you know, I sort of like my position still. There he's getting rid of a couple curses. He still has one left. He's up on points for sure, but I, I think I just have a much stronger deck, a much stronger engine going on. And we'll see. Let's So, so he had a seven card hand. And there's four cards out of it. He's got three left. He could potentially actually be buying the province if they're gold, gold, silver here. Uh, and we're waiting for him. Let me make sure I'm not frozen. Okay. So we're seeing what's going on here. I'm hoping he doesn't really have bad connection issues. Um, wow, okay. Um, he's getting another silver. It's probably the right play for him at this point. Um, so this could make it a little bit interesting and difficult for you guys at home watching. Um, yes, we want those villages. This doesn't matter. We can play our wharf, our herbalist. This is going to be 14 money. We can afford to trash uh, Let's see, what do we want to trash? 14 money. We need to be able to get some more cash. So I'm going to trash two coppers, buy two golds, return a gold to the top. Got lots and lots of wharfs. And, uh, yeah, pretty soon here, I'm just going to start mowing down VP. And in the meantime, I'm going to have to watch and, and make sure I have much better control over 
when the game's going to end, so I'm going to just have to watch and make sure that uh, he's not going to be able to end it favorably for him. So I may have to grind down some duchies, but I, I believe in my stronger engine to be able to win here pretty well. Playing my whole deck every turn, and uh, I should be able to double province here pretty reliably in a second. So um, I guess while we're waiting here for his internet issues to hopefully resolve, I'll talk a little more about the opening play. Um, now my young witch is pretty unuseful now, um, although it, it's going to soon be providing me a slight warehouse effect, and I think I have enough villages that I can definitely uh, spare the actions for it, um, as opposed to his familiar. Now my young witch... I got a bad collision at the start. He got a very good collision that he was able to hit familiar and then trash down four cards. I was able to only trash three cards and not play my young witch. So there's a big deal right there. But in spite of that, um, he spent a turn buying the potion. Then he had to have it in his deck for a while. He trashed it. And let's see what he does here on a six. Um, Village, 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 wharf, uh, young witch, so that I can discard the stuff, so that I can redraw it with these villages. Herbalist, 18 money province. Province. I'm gonna go with another pearl diver here. And a copper, because I want that one extra money. Let's put this gold back up. Um good. I I have this wharf. And a village to play it with, so the pearl divers are going to help me smooth out my engine, so that's nice. Here he's going to get another province probably. Um, I need to make sure to not double province here probably, um, just in case he can do a lot. Although, wait, quite frankly, he can't, can he? One moment, we'll check in a second. Uh, he has one wharf to my four, so he's not going to be able to play one. Uh, he has no villages to my five, no young witch, one familiar he could play potentially. Mm -hmm. um, play village, wharf, village, wharf, village, pearl diver. I want that wharf on top of my deck. That's the great thing from the pearl diver. Uh, pearl diver again. Yeah, let's put the village up there. Young witch. Provinces go down. Herbalists. And this is just enough money to double province, should I want to. Now, uh, that draw pile looks like a couple cards big. Um, potentially the play is familiar. How much cash does he have left in his deck? Let's see. 15 coppers trashed. Um, 15. That seems like a little too many. Anyway, he doesn't have much, many left. Um, well, let's see. If I double province, uh, then he could, I think, potentially tie if he got province in a state. He still has this curse. Maybe if he's able to trash that, he could win anyway. I think it's a really good high percentage play if I double province, but a higher percentage play if I province duchy and, uh, oh, let's say silver, because I have three wards in play. Um, he's not going to be able to double province for sure. And uh, 
I should be able to do quite well on my next turn. Um, he just doesn't have enough money in his deck to double province. Uh, if we check it out, I have four silvers, which means he can't have more than five. Um, wait, maybe I have five. I don't know. But say he had five and two golds. That's enough if he drew all seven of those cards to be able to double province, but he can't do that. Um, and yeah, here we have the chapel and the curse. So he's gotten rid of the curse. Um, and wow, this is a over 15 minute video. I hope that it will be able to upload. If not, I'll have to work out some way to do that. Maybe I'll ask Johns because he uploaded one that was longer than 15 minutes a little while ago, if I recall correctly. Um, but yeah, I think this was this is a product of two things, my stronger deck at this point. One uh, is that he went for Potion Familiar off the start and then didn't back that up by getting more Familiars or Alchemists, um, which would be the only way in my mind to justify Familiar over Young Witch anyway. Now, Young Witch actually had a pretty decent bane in Village because Village you're very likely to want here to play a big action chain, especially with Chapel to trash you down. Also, ch Chapel trashing you down is going to be able to deal with those curses. Now, he chapeled his potion later, but um, that took time, a lot of time, even though it actually fell pretty well for him. And then the other probably bigger difference is that he went... Um, basically chapel and familiar for big money and then started greening pretty quick um, which isn't terrible but is definitely going to be inferior to getting more wars more money at least built up he, he started greening I think too fast didn't spend enough time building up his economy um, which I guess part of that was also afforded to me by probably hitting him better with curses as I was somehow cycling faster. Uh, probably the Young Witch did that a lot for me and aggressive chaplain, I'm not sure. Um, I got much more of an economy built up and I think that's really the big big difference in this game. Let me make sure it's not me that's lagging. Great, it's not. Um, so this game is This game is going to be over shortly. Um, I can probably end it with a win on my next turn. Um, if not, I'm going to have it just locked down based on score differential pretty soon. Um, like, he has a nominal... Oh, wait, I even have a nominal lead here. Oh, I probably could have double province there. And, uh... Well, whatever. No, that's, I, I, I still think I made the right play. Um, also note that, uh, oh, I don't want to make him resign. Uh, also note that this is a, a key in endgame idea. If he has enough money here to double province, that's the only way I can lose soon, and my deck is going to be strong enough that it's basically the only way I could lose it all. Now, um, if he had enough money to double province here, and I double province last turn, then, um, then he would have enough money to province and duchy here, of course, because enough to double province is definitely going to be enough to province and duchy, which would have him win anyway. So, uh, this way there's a small chance I lose but all of that chance is subsumed by uh, the chance that I'd lost with my other decision, which really makes it a no-brainer. And he's resigned, it says. Oh, I hope that wasn't a disconnection. Um, I, I guess we'll have to see how this is going to work out tournament-wise. Um, comments or questions on YouTube? Oh, headache. Thanks very much.